just in. Unconfirmed reports of an accident at Southland Park. I can't find my boy! Hundreds of family members gathered outside the deserted park today to commemorate the second anniversary of the Southland Park tragedy. Full investigation of the park's safety Authorities report at least 30 deaths and close to 100 Five years injuries. since the tragedy closed the gates of Southland Park, but new evidence is claiming form. malicious prosecution and believes Says he'll be he vindicated at last. every penny of his fortune the defending Legal himself Eagles from these Dream lawsuits. Team. Defending Southland Park all oh the There were people flying everywhere. Body parts, and the victim's blood. families oh have God. vowed to appeal the decision. Not guilty. Cleared of all charges. Come, have a cup of tea, hon. Sitting in the dark won't bring him back, sweetheart. This training level will introduce to you the various skills and Welcome to the States, 47. This should be a straightforward operation. We need you to penetrate an abandoned amusement park, locate the owner, and take him out. The target is a Joseph Clarence, also known as Swing King. An accident involving one of the rides at the park a few years back forced him to close it down. Our client has made a special request that the photograph you have in your possession be the last thing the target sees. Mr. Clarence has somehow become involved with a narcotics distribution ring, so the park may still have some amusements. Enjoy the ride, 47. What the fuck you looking at, Kraken? I'm here to see Joseph Clarence. Never heard of him. Mr. Swing King? Oh, that sorry ass dickhead. What the fuck they call you? Names of a friends, so I don't need one. <laughs> oh.
Gotta check you, white bread. No weapons past me, motherfucker. Hold up! Hey! Stop that son of a bitch! I can get the money, sweetie. It's as good as mine already. Mr. Spook's got it. We'll open the park. It'll be like old times. No, no, just a few more days. You gotta believe me. Won't say that, sunshine. Mr. Spook's gonna come through, baby. He's good for the money. I won't sign the papers. I won't. You gotta give me one more chance. You gotta. Baby cakes? Sunshine? Hello?
it's uh, it's been a while now, uh, Scoop, and I was just wondering uh, where we were on the whole money thing. Were you? Yeah, see, the thing is, if you remember, you know what we agreed to was it'd just be a short while and you'd pay in cash and... Uh, and uh, I know the what the pressure was you were under must be, but the deal is a deal, and I was hoping, you know, maybe you could just pay what we agreed on, even though you've been here for, heck, more than twice as long as we agreed to, but, but just pay the original amount and move on. Not right away, necessarily, but, you know, I'd appreciate it. No. You wrap it, do she? Depends who's unwrapping me. God damn, girl. I'd have your fine ass unwrapped before you could say, Who's that handsome stud on time I river? I bet you could. Oops. <laughs> That's Uncle Joe. Better get back to your post.
Who the hell are you? How'd you get in here? Carol Ann! My client has hired me to show you this photograph. I don't understand. My client has asked me to ensure it's the last thing you ever see. Please, look at the photograph, Mr. Clarence. Oh, please. Haven't I suffered enough? Don't you think I know how much suffering I'm responsible for? I can't sleep. I haven't slept in... The guilt I feel. I'm so sorry. I know I can never... My orders that caused the problem? Is that what you're trying to say? Nah, Scoops, I ain't say that shit. I'd like to give you a lesson in personal responsibility, Jay. But see. Seeing as there's an intruder on the premises, I'm a little pressed for time. So I'm afraid you'll have to be a lesson in personal responsibility. Those of you wishing to avoid becoming corollaries to Jay's theory of accountability had better get moving. Check upstairs, downstairs, inside, outside. Now 